Berlin. So the last time we chatted with you, we were in Amsterdam, Amsterdam. Mm -hmm. uh, and we made it all the way to Germany mm -hmm. uh, to visit some family and friends. Uh, there's been um, several days in between, so yeah. we landed in Una, which is near Dusseldorf and Dortmund, yeah. which is northern, closer to the Netherlands border. And then we spent um, a day or so in Cologne. Cologne, yeah. But now we are in Berlin, as we had said, and today we are out on a little photo and video bike tour. This is an incredible city. Mm -hmm. um, it reminds me a lot of New York City yeah. with uh, little districts or boroughs. But right now we are in the museum. Yeah, Museumsinsel, which is Museum Isle. So there's um, like the Spree is the river here and it's um, dividing two areas where there's museums, lots of museums. Yep. Um, I forgot my mic because I didn't <laughs> think about that this morning. We got up at six to do this because otherwise it is insanely busy. So I apologize if the sound is absolute garbage. Um, anyways, we're gonna continue on with this yeah. and hopefully we can show you around as much as we can. But check this freaking gallery out. It's absolutely incredible. It's amazing, really cool architecture and you can pretty much see everything from all the different views. But okay. We're gonna hop on our bikes and we're gonna continue with the tour. So we yeah. will see you in a bit. I think my favorite part out of the city so far is cruising around on bikes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, we're staying in a district called Mitte, which is stands for middle, but um, it's a beautiful, really neat area. And we rented some bikes. So if you get here, you can find these little bikes. And they're super convenient. Uh, the city is actually pretty easy to navigate. All these spots that we're hitting today, um, if you're just biking them and you're not stopping to take photos or whatever, it is 30 minutes. Okay, so we are at the Brattenburger Trois. Which is the main monument here in Berlin. Everyone might have like it's pretty famous. I it's think. pretty famous. You've probably seen this in movies, lots of different movies. And the light here is absolutely epic. Mm -hmm. So we just finished taking some photos and some video. If you want to get good shots of this beautiful light, you gotta come early. Yeah. Just like there. Yeah. And just like <laughs> we are. We did. Alright, so we're gonna continue on to the next spot. Yeah. We have a few more, and then maybe coffee. first a coffee. We've already done this tour a little bit to kind of figure out where we wanted to take some photos. So um, uh, it was super busy, but this city is perfect for doing bikes. Oh, another hilarious thing about our bikes <laughs> by this company is they're all named. So Katarina has Catwoman and today I am Svenja. So, all right. so. Off to the next spot and to find some coffee because there are some Very great. really cool coffee shops.
Okay, so you're probably wondering, we're on a bike tour, but then now there's some food on the screen. So while I was editing this, I realized um, it didn't make a lot of sense because I wanted to include this little sequence. Uh, this is actually from the day before. Um, I had mentioned right before that that we had already did this little bike tour the day before just to plan out some of our spots and make it a little bit more efficient. But that evening, our friends, um, Chris and Lowry, uh, took us on an amazing experience. And what you're about to see, uh, the remainder of the sequence is actually from Coda Dessert Dining, which is uh, not just a dinner experience or a dessert bar. They only serve dessert, um, but it is a sort of a food journey. Um, super interesting. It's kind of hard to explain on camera right now, but it is a two Michelin star restaurant. They focus on dessert, but try to make the food not dessert focused. If that makes any sense. I don't know. Anyways, keep watching this sequence. And if you're ever in Berlin, definitely check it out. Uh, thanks for listening. And now back to the vlog. Guys, we just found an insane photo spot. Mm -hmm. um, I, it's super popular on Instagram, yeah. so um, we'll put a tag in it. But it was really neat, and we hadn't come here on our first day, but I was pretty adamant about coming here. Coming here, and I think it was worth it for the photos. Oh yeah, oh yeah. best photos. Um, but anyways, here it is. <laughs> Okay, I guess we should grab our stuff and then we'll get going back to the bikes. But I'll talk about it. So it's an event center. It has this really neat structure to the roof. And we're not even sure if you can allow it to climb on, but I think a lot of people do. Yeah. I don't think they really care. And it's closed, so. Yeah, it's closed. Uh, really quiet here. There's not a single person here. No. But the funny thing is, I think this area um, is an area where people drink and party and have a couple drinks at night so, yeah. uh, it's right across from this really nice soccer field sorry football field yeah football. so beautiful and there is just um, a little sitting area but <laughs> there's there's bottles of beer bottles of gin so I think there was a bit of a party here last night yeah it's a little out of the way from all the really cool spots. Yeah, it's a little southwest, which is not where we would usually go, I think, but it was worth it. Yeah, it was, it was worth it to come here. And... Okay, so we are at our last stop on this little bike tour, mm -hmm. and this area is absolutely beautiful. Mm -hmm. um, it is the government yeah. area. So we're surrounded by government buildings, and the building that we're looking at across the river is the Reichstag, Reichstag which is the uh, main German government building. That's where the German government sits and makes all the important decisions. Yeah, I think I think that this area is really interesting to me because it's a mixture of old and new. Yeah. Yeah, yeah so there's the that classic government building and then it's just mixed in with beautiful modern beautiful and modern architecture. Check that. 
check that out. And there's the river that goes right along, right? The river? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Spray. the Spray River. And there's beautiful bikers. And the light right now is absolutely beautiful. Yeah. It's a really neat area. It's like super pedestrian friendly, super bike friendly. Mm -hmm. And um, I think the, they're super chill about people coming and visiting. Yeah, and I think they almost encourage you to hang out in this area um, because they want you to be around politics and the government because it's part of your country. Yeah, it's neat. On the other side of that main government building, there's this big field and this big park. And when we were by it the other day, everybody was... Uh, drinking beer. Drinking beer yeah. because you're allowed to drink here in public and having a little picnic. Sitting in the park just right outside the government yeah, building. Yeah, it's absolutely incredible. Yeah. Um, I think that's pretty much it for today. Mm -hmm. We might have one more stop mm -hmm. because in this area, there's just so much, so many beautiful photo spots. Yeah. So um, I'm going to try to hop on the bike and mm -hmm. film a little bit. Mm -hmm. And as well, you probably saw some other really nice shots, but we will do that. And then, then? coffee. Finally, coffee. That was a super cool bike photo mission. I highly recommend doing that whether you take photos or not. Yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. Early morning in Berlin. Yeah. The early mornings in Berlin are good because it's we got up at six and now it's gonna get busy. And our friend Laura's here. <laughs> Good morning. Good morning.